these supposed matriarchs all cowered in their apartments in fear of the depredations of teenage boys. Societies that were described by Daniel Patrick Moynihan and other sociologists as matriarchal because right. uh, the women ruled the family. There were the men, the, there were female headed families. Uh, these supposed matriarchs all cowered in their apartments in fear of the depredations of teenage boys. It was really violent teenage boys who dominated those cultures in the inner city. Right. And, and creating a s ostensible matriarchy of, of financed by wealth, with the welfare state. Uh, I said the, these, uh, the fathers of the black family were cuckolded by the welfare state. Yes. Uh, didn't uh, uh, make men into uh, non-entities. They made men into criminals. Into and gangsters. Gangsters. So, yeah. the, so that's what, um, yeah, let's good, pursue, that for, pursue that for a minute. Let's say a young woman in the inner city gets pregnant. And uh, in the old regime, there could quite likely be a shotgun marriage or some sort of yeah. arranged marriage yeah. that would come out of that. Yeah. But let's say the dad, the father of the child is 19 years old and has a job sweeping out a warehouse. Mm. If the federal government swoops in and says, we will provide you with payments, mm. provided you don't marry this guy. Yeah. Right. Because if you marry this guy, you're yeah. not, you're not eligible. If, yeah, yeah. if, if, right. if that's, you, that's the welfare state. Right. So what, what they've done is they've subsidized Male, ir male irresponsibility. That's right. And they've liberated men. They purport to be liberating women, but in fact, they liberate men to exploit women. Right.